Good morning, my friends. If you didn't catch me yesterday, happy Thanksgiving again. We need to give thanks every day, not just on Thanksgiving, okay, my friends? Let's give thanks every day. Give thanks to the Lord for his good, for his mercy, and endureth forever. This morning, we got finished with uh, Judges, the book of Judges yesterday. So guess what are we in now? I thought it was going to be in Samuel. I, I, forgive me, I'm sorry I said Samuel, but no, Ruth, Ruth's stuck in there. Ruth is right after Judges. I was wrong. I'm human just like everybody else, okay? I'm not I'm not perfect. I try my best to be perfect, but right now we're in the book of Ruth. Ruth is a little short real, short little short book right before Samuel. Her name is Ruth. We're gonna read about Ruth this morning. Let's lodge with our Lord. That's our topic this morning. Let's lodge with our Lord. Your poles for station. Ooh, don't get started up curly show. It's all about Jesus, not about old curly. It's all about Jesus. Yeah. Look at Ruth. Ruth 1, chapter 1 of Ruth. 116. I believe my mother might have said this verse back in the day, one day. And Ruth said, Entreat me not to leave thee, or to return from following after thee. For whither thou goest, I will go, and where thou lodge, I will lodge. Thy people shall be my people, and thy God, my God. Yeah, I just heard yesterday. I'm that on November fifth on my mother, on my uh, my sister's birthday. We one one the past when she was twenty four, and my mother, my mother, my mother passed too. She she passed two thousand fourteen. She was Connie number one. Back in the day, we had a Connie number two. Connie number Miss Connie Ann Tater. Miss Connie Ann Tater, not Miss Connie Ann Tater. Miss Connie Ann Woods. She she passed. She passed November fifth. So yeah, please, please pray for my pray for my my niece. That was her mother. My niece, my two my two nieces, Cassie and Christy. Please pray for them. That was their mother. She's she's in heaven. She said she was saved before I knew. Whenever when I uh, when I spoke at her uh, at my brother's mother's funeral, my brother had my half brother, half brother Kevin. I, I spoke at her, his mother's funeral. I remember she was there, and I was. I said, okay, I want to see her again. You can't get saved by his grace through faith. Cause I'm, this, this, uh, this Aunt Taylor, she's in, she's in heaven, I believe. I'm praying and hoping that Connie was saved. I believe she said she was. And I just got to trust that. You know what I mean? I, I share the word of God with people and trust that they get saved. That's all we can do, guys. That's all we can do. But we're going to read this verse, this verse one more time. Ruth 1.16. Ruth 1.16. And Ruth said, Entreat me not to leave thee. Or to return from the following after thee. For whither thou goest, I will go. Whereas thou lodgest, I will lodge. Thy people shall be my people, and thy God shall be my God. So let's lodge with our Lord daily, guys. Let's, 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 let's stay in his presence daily. Let's stay with him. Y'all please pray with me. Dear Lord Jesus, help us all this morning. Lord Jesus, please help us all. Focus on you and your word, and not get distracted by this ungodly, sinful, temporary world, Lord. We never know what our, when our life's going to be gone, Lord. What is our life? Our life is even as a vapor. That appeared for a little time, but then vanisheth away, Lord Jesus. Help us all focus on you and your word, Lord. Help my boys this morning to focus on you and your word, Lord, every single day of their lives, Lord. Please, Jesus, touch my boy, my young men. Please help them know, help them know I love them, Lord. Touch their hearts, let them know I love them today. I should have missed them. I missed them all day yesterday. I tried to call them. <laughs> Please, Lord, just help the situation, Lord Jesus. Bring us back together and get us talking again. I don't know what what they're holding grudges. I don't know what's going on, Lord. Please just, but you got a plan for everything, Lord Jesus. You are in control of everybody's life. Please, don't let the devil kill, steal, and destroy. Okay, but you, you, Jesus, you come give us life and more abundantly. The devil, he's like a roaring lion, singing whom he may devour. He is the prince and power of the air, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience, as you say in John 10, 10, 1 Peter 5, 8, and Ephesians 2, 2, help us all, Jesus. Help us focus on your word and live for your word, not for this ungodly, simple, temporary world, Lord. Help us, Jesus. Help me here this morning as I preach. Thank you so much. In your precious holy name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. All right, my friends. I found a song yesterday that I love. Ooh, that I love saying the choirs many times before. Hello, Mr. Adil, Mr. Justice. I can't read all y'all, but God bless y'all. Thank you for tuning in this morning. Praise the Lord. We got to trust in the Lord, guys. Trust in the Lord, folks. If I'll one more second. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. 
lean not into that own understanding. I don't understand why things are going where they're going, but God's got to pray for everything. We got to trust in the Lord with all thy heart. Lean not into thy own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy path. Be not wise in thy own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart. Be not wise in thy own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from Eva. Fear the Lord means respect him, reverence him. Know he is in control. That's the Lord Savior Jesus Christ. He is in control. Without him, we burn eternally in hell. Jesus Christ is the answer, the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me, as he says in John fourteen six. It's not me. Don't ever get distracted and think that it's me getting you out of heaven. It's not me. It's Jesus Christ. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me, in John fourteen six. That's him. He is saying me, not me. That's his word I'm quoting, okay? We need to live for him, my friends. Let's follow him, folks. Go to Matthew 4, 19 real quick. Y'all please turn to Matthew 4, 19. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Woo, let the earth hear his voice. Thank you for tuning in. God is so awesome. He's so powerful. 4, 19. 4, 19. What the Bible says right here. And he saith unto him, Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. That's Jesus Christ speaking in red right there. That's not me. It's not. Don't follow me. Follow Jesus, Okay. Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. As Jesus Christ says right there in Matthew 4, 19. That's Jesus Christ talking to them. And, and, and yeah, he is powerful. We need to share the news and love him, folks. We need to share the news of Christ and love him, folks. Every single day of our life, we ought to go ye and draw the world and preach the gospel to every creature. It says like in Mark 16, 15. Okay, we ain't go tell people about Jesus, not tell people about Joe. You hear what Joey says? Don't worry about me. It's all about Jesus. I share his word. I talk about Jesus. Okay, it's all about Jesus, not me. I'm just here for him. I'm his messenger. Share the news and love him, folks. Because we never know. Well, like I was saying earlier, what is our life? What is your life? Your life is even as a vapor that appears for a little time, but then vanisheth away. We never know when our last day is going to be. I think they said yesterday that Connie, uh, Connie, uh, Connie Woods, she was, uh, 52, 52 or 53. We never know my mom passed when she was 61. And I'm, I just turned 44, so my clock's ticking. All of our clocks are ticking. We need to get saved by His grace through faith before it's too late, my friends. Before it's too late. I'm happy. Well, I know where I'm going. Because if you believe on the name of the Son of God, you know you have eternal life. If you believe on the name of the Son of God. While we're not that saying to them, my friends, you must be born again. There's none other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved, my friends. As I, John 3, 7 and Acts 4, 12. Because for God so loved the world. Woo, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Whosoever believed in him should not perish but have everlasting life, my friends. Everlasting life. Hello, man. Good morning to you. Good morning, sir. Good morning. I can't speak to all y'all, but God bless y'all. Thank y'all so much. Praise the Lord. No one knows when he's coming, my friends. No one knows when our day, our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ is coming. No one knows the day nor the hour of his return. We're going to, we're going to Matthew twenty four thirty six, Matthew twenty Marty and Matthew right now. Matthew twenty four thirty six, right here. It's long. I, I, want to, I want to quote it just right. But of that day and hour knoweth no man. No, not the angels of heaven, but my Father only. My Father only knows the day. But of that day and hour knoweth no man. No, not the angels of heaven, but my Father only. Because the day of the Lord, my friends, is going to come as the, like a thief in the night. Says so like in First Thessalonians five two. Is he calling you, my friends? Is he calling you to you? Is he wanting to use you? Are you sharing his word with this world, with this lost and dying, sinful, temporary world? Let not things which are seen, for the things which are seen are temporal. But things which are not seen are eternal. It's all about Jesus, my friends. It's all about Jesus. We need. We need to go to. Let's go to Philippians three. 14. Oh my God, I had it right here. Had it right here. I had it right here because we need, we need, is he calling you, my friends? Is he, is he wanting to use you? Because I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. Is he calling you, my friends? Is he calling you? Well, let's, let's praise his holy name every single day of our lives, my friends. That was Philippians 3 14. Because I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ, and you should not be ashamed either. There's the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth. To everyone that believeth. Let's seek him, guys. Let's love him more, my friends. Let's love him more because if we love him because he first loved us, says like 1 John 4, 19. We love him because he first 
Love thus. Yes, let's love him, guys. Well, I got to get out there and door dash a little bit today because I don't get paid down. I'm trying to door dash. And when I get door dash, what do I get to do? I get to share the news of Christ. Every time I pick up food to go take it, so whoever's there waiting on food, guess what they're hearing? They're hearing about Jesus. Every one of them are hearing about Jesus. I encourage you, my friends, if you're saved by his grace through faith, please write up your own testimony how you was before and how God changed your life, how you got saved and how God changed your life and how you live for him now. Let's let's all go ye and all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. Let's let people know about Jesus, my friends. Let's let people know about Jesus. I'm go. I gotta go fix my headlight. One of my headlights is messed up. I think something to do with the wire and hub. I please pray I can get that fixed today for cheap. You know, cause I gotta work today too. I got DoorDash. I gotta spread the word to cry when I pick up food. Spread the word of Jesus and go deliver the food. Spread the word of Jesus. Praise the Lord. But yeah, y'all please pray with me, dear Lord Jesus. Help us all focus on you and your word, Lord. Help us all to love you. And lodge with you, Lord. Help us all <laughs> live for you and not for this ungodly, simple, temporary world, Lord. Please, Jesus, help us all focus on you and your word. Your word is way, the word when they flesh dwelt among us, full of grace and truth. That's you, Lord. You are the word, Lord. Help us, Lord, to read it, learn it, love it, live it, and share it. Help us to dig in and try not to sin. That, draw, that verse of John 4, 1, 14. Help people go back and read, write it down, read it, read it later. Focus on your word. Your word was going to last forever. The grass withers. Flower fades with the word of our God shall stand forever. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but your words, Lord, your words I will not pass away. Help us, Jesus. Help us on you and your word. Help me here this morning as I sing. Thank you so much. Help my, my young men. Help them focus on you and your word, Lord Jesus. Help them know that I love them. Every single day I pray for them. Please, Jesus, help help my whole family, Lord. Thank you so much for my brother and his his girls and his wife and my brother Kevin. Help, help us all, Lord Jesus. Please have a touch my dad's heart, Lord. Save his soul, please, Jesus. Thank you so much. Please help us all. Help me here this morning as I sing. In your name, precious holy name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. All right, my friends. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mr. Mr. Miss Miss Mary Mary teachers. Miss uh, and I, I can't name all y'all on there, but I, I, I thank y'all so much. God bless y'all. Pause one more second. Now here's a good song. I want y'all sing it with me. I love you, Lord, for your mercy never failed me all my days. I've been held in your hands from the moment that I wake up until I lay my head. Oh, I will sing of the goodness of God. All my life you have been faithful. Woo, yes, Lord. All my life you have been so, so good. Every breath that I am able, I will see the goodness of God. Woo-hoo, y'all sing it with me, y'all friends. <laughs> it's, 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 I may mess up the end of it. The goodness of God, that's what it is. All my days I've been, oh, hold on. I love you, Lord. Let's start with the first part. For your mercy never fell me all my days. I've been held in your hands. From the moment that I wake up until I lay my head, oh, I will sing of the goodness of God. Sing with me. Here's the chorus. All my life you have been faithful. Woo! All my life you have been so, so good. Every breath that I am able, I will see of the goodness of God. Woo! Come on, guys and gals. Praise the Lord every single day of our lives, my friends. Let's go ye into all the world, praise the gospel to every creature. Well, I gotta get out here and go fix my light and try to door dash a little bit, make it make me the money. I'd rather just preach all day if, if that's ever possible, but please, Lord. He's got a plan for everything. We got to make him up. If a man don't eat, man don't work, right? Remember that scripture? I don't know exactly right now, but I think it's in Psalms, maybe. Man don't eat, he don't work. So we got to eat, guys. We got to, we got to, we got to work to where we can provide. He is the main provider. He is the sustainer. He is the protector. Let's pray one more time. Dear Lord Jesus, help us all, Lord. If we're not saved by your grace through faith, help us all get saved right now, Lord. Help us all accept you into our hearts and you forgive us from our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness, Lord. As you say in First John 1, I love the way you put the Holy Spirit, but scripture in my mind. I love it, Lord. So powerful, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Because greater is you that is in me than you that is in me. 
Greater he that is in me than he is in the world. It's all about Jesus, my friends. And the Satan is in this world trying to manipulate us, trying to confuse us and distract us away from Jesus. Help us all say focus on Jesus. Help us all say focus on you, my, you my Lord and Savior. Thank you, Jesus. Help us all say focus on you. Please help us all. Guide us all. Direct us all. Keep us all safe in everything we do. In your precious holy name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. My friends, yes, sir. Y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.